One black person in Bray. Mm. Me. <laughs> one. One, man, imagine that. One is about in 20,000. One. <laughs> First black man in Bray. <laughs> no way. <laughs> 1960. Wow. 1960. I, uh, I was born down the country in Tipperary and I come here when I. 1960. I live here all the time. Wow. And how, how was that for you, like growing up as a black Irishman in the middle of like uh, loads of white people and European? Yeah, John, I didn't see a uh, black person. Till I was 12. Mm. I went to Dublin with my mother to shop. Right. I saw a black person. I said, oh, look. <gasps> look there's more. I thought it was just me. I thought it was special. <laughs> I thought it was special. No Everyone really. tell me I'm special, you know? Really? Did you think that? Yeah. And then uh, so I said, stop, stop, stop. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay. Mm. So uh, then I found out there's more. Mm. Okay. But <laughs> <laughs> for growing up was good. All, 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 all the, all the, all the girls wanted to kiss me, and all the boys wanted to fight me. Really, so man. So good life. <laughs> good I can, life. I can't imagine, it, man. I can't imagine. It. So how old are you now? Sixty-three. Sixty-three. Wow. You're looking good, bro. Thank you. <laughs> uh, uh, very young. You could you could say like I'm 40, 40 something. Ah well. <laughs> but I like my age. Yeah. Because you're I've right. done so much. I've been so much to so much. Uh, I've been to so much difficulties in my life. Mm. That to get to 63, is, I never thought I'd get that far. You know. Mm-hmm. And uh, I'm happy now. Mm. I've achieved my my what I wanted to do. I've done what I wanted to do. I'm still doing it in my house. It never mm -hmm. finish. Never, never finish. Never finish. All that new work here. So <laughs> I did, did do this, do this. Yeah, I can. There's always work. And here. what I want to talk about, I see you are a very artistic person. Like uh, when, when we met the first time, I, best, I what I noticed the like the details of the house outside is like a very unique. All this work, you know? and, uh, yeah, I like the look. Look, look at that, man. That's yeah. beautiful. But when, when did you start to get an interest with art? Like, do you remember, like... No, I only start building about... I bought this house in 89. Right. 89, and... Uh, I just got all bits, you know, I do... I, I'm working as a builder. Right. So all the f bits, all the rubbish that's finished... Mm. I've come home mm. and build all of now. Oh, I the get, leftovers you get? Leftovers, yeah. Oh, right, right. And so this house is built out of leftovers. <laughs> no this way. This is from a down the thing. So all recycled. You recycle it. recycled, yeah. Pope wow. down the thing. This, wow. these, are, these are all of a Pope downtown. Mm. They knock down the Pope and I, these come out and I take them for myself. Wow. And see these here? Look how thick is that. Do you see these here? Yeah. These are all doors, like this. Ah, so doors. you put together? Put half, yeah. Wow, what a brilliant idea, bro. No, you have to insulate the back foam and insulation. Mm. Plastic, all this. Okay. Wow. And these are all, all these, uh, yeah, old floorboards. Mm -hmm. Look, telegraph pole. See? <laughs> okay, the posts, you took all the posts outside? Yeah. Like yeah. the, the people they were throwing yeah, I away? Yeah, from the, from the electricity people. All oh, oh. right. I see this here. Mm. See this here? You see. What's this? Church pew. From church. No way. See, see the seats? Yeah. Can you can sit see. in the church? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, now I can see that. <laughs> 
So make everything out of everything, you know? Mm-hmm. Use your mind. Yeah, Smoke man. Smoke joint. <laughs> Think and, so, oh, yeah, I do this, I do this. Yeah. Smoke Let the imagination go. The imagination go. <laughs> I see, like, the concealer that are old. So I do this myself out of wood. Right. Yeah, it's just... I see magazines. Uh, right. Television, see everything, and then just... And I collect everything. Mm -hmm. All my life I've always You're been a, collector. a hoarder, collector. <laughs> mm -hmm. I collect things and... Like, sure. uh, what do you call it? Everything. Hey, yeah. What is that? This is uh, the world. I'm going to paint and make into the world. You know? Ah. Really cool. The world, this is, in my opinion, the world. I'm going to paint this blue. Right. I make it the world, okay? Okay. Put this in here. I got it. <laughs> what is it? What is it? A world of snowflakes. <laughs> Not the world I grew up in. Everyone's on weak now. Yeah. Where you work hard, children no machine. Mm -hmm. Work hard, everything you make yourself with your hands. Mm -hmm. Now everything is computer on the phone. Yeah. Idiots. Snowflakes. There's no flakes. They're no good. <laughs> too weak. The minute they get a bit of trouble, my children too. Mm. The minute they get a bit of trouble, mm. they they go right. cry. They're weak. So so we are building like a weak people. Yeah, more the more the snowflakes. <laughs> That's your analogy of the world right now. I grew up uh, very tough, you know. Mm -hmm. I had to work hard. And if I fall, I hope myself no, no hospital to walk, walk, walk. Mm. Yeah, everything struggle. Yeah, man. You know? And but now, now, the whole world is too comfortable. Everybody have television, phones, everybody have everything. And they're all got soft, they're not strong. Mm -hmm. but and they... my, my children have two sons. Mm -hmm. One of them's okay, the other one's weak. Mm. Now, they're, they're only strong karate, you can fight them very strong, but weak here. Mm, I know what you if mean. If you get problem, they can't solve it. I had to be on Google. No Google. They are so lost. <laughs> what happened tomorrow if the one world order mm. take away Google? What happened? What happened? <laughs> if they take away internet. They're gonna have to find all another way. All the snowflakes will die. Yeah. Because they know it's, it's artificial, it's not real. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I grew up in the real world mm -hmm. with real people and real problems and real things. This is an artificial world mm -hmm. that they make for all the children. They can't cook. All they can do is fuck, you know. But after after one year, this is you get fed up with this. Uh huh. Who will ever know? <laughs> Look at the design, man. Yeah. You see, I collect everything, you know. Mm-hmm, but uh, you have a good good taste, I mean, you know? Well, people say I'm crazy because I pick everything up. Well, <laughs> I pick everything up because, like these, like, see these here? Mm. These came out of a convent. A convent? Everything has a, hi a history, right? Yeah. Oh, my father. Okay. He was here, he was here trying to be a doctor. Mm. And he was in the college in town trying to be a doctor, you know? And he came home to my mother's house for Christmas mm -hmm. to eat food and celebrate the Christmas. Mm -hmm. And I think my mother liked Got him. Got interest. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. A know, different guy. Diggy, dig, 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 at the moment. So you diggy, came diggy, up yeah. after that. And, uh, <laughs> wow, man. I was born September 25th. So I go back nine months. 25th of December. Really? Wow. 25th September is my birth, birth right? Mm -hmm. So I go back nine months, mm -hmm. 25th is December. In, in Christmas time? Yeah, Chris, Santi. When Santi come, when Father Christmas come. So who brought me? Who's my father? Father Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Santi bring me. <laughs> Man. Father Christmas bring me, yeah? <laughs> thank you for... You're welcome. Me. You're welcome and, and thank you for showing interest. <laughs>